The last two types of conflicts um, are very similar um, conceptually to each other. Um, those are synonyms and equivalent classes. Um, in ontologies, they are treated differently. But conceptually, to the user's eyes, they're just terms having similar meanings. Um, because in the ontology, they're going to treat it differently, and the UI need to be designed a little bit differently. So we have um, put them as two separate categories. Um, let's um, use um, leaf sheets as an example. So leaf sheets is a term. Um, the question asks, which of the following terms are exchangeable with leaf sheets regardless of context? Meaning, no, no matter where this term is used, can they um, be replaced with leaf sheets without changing the meaning? So one is leaf sheets underscore with the underscore, another is sheath. Um, since Brax could have sheets too, maybe leaf sheets would be the only exactly synonym, no matter, regardless of the context, to leaf sheets. So we can select this. Again, this um, has the definition for this leaf sheets here. Um, you could also select the none above. Um, so we can submit. Um, you've decided that leaf sheets is not exchangeable with sheets. Right, we decided leaf sheets is not exchangeable with sheets. It's exchangeable only with leaf sheets. Okay. Um, you can enter the reason why you think that sheets is not um, um, black sheets. And that's how we um, remove some synonyms that's not good. Um, the, the other um, equivalent terms um, very similar. So this um, apical tooth, again, it will give you the definition and example sentences. If there is an image, then the image is going to show here. Um, which of the follow the question that we ask you is which of the following terms are equivalent with apical tooth regardless of context? Um, again, as I said, the this uh, this equivalent term and synonyms are very very similar um, to each other, but technical reasons we need to separate them. It's easier for the programmers to handle um, the back end. Um, so in this case, I don't think apical tooth is equivalent to apex, therefore I'm going to remove that. Um, um, I should be, remo should be able to remove that and then submit. This is my, I, I decided on this term earlier. And now I'm correcting my error by removing this checkbox. It should allow me to submit. There must be a bug somewhere. I'll report this bug to my developer. But I think you got the idea. Um, I noticed also a inconsistency earlier. We called it others comments. And here it's others reasons. We need to make them consistent. It's, it's others comments. Um, Okay, I think this concludes um, my video demonstration also discovered two issues. Um, miscellaneous, we don't have anything yet. And we, when we have new, um, identified a new type of um, issues that we need experts to resolve, we will um, um, develop um, additional um, other types of conflicts. So to summarize, what um, I need from you is to um, watch the video and imagine you're using this app um, 
and see if um, the logics that I explained in the videos make sense to you. If there are things that need to be changed, um, any inconsistencies, um, the I can the video um, I can actually have this app is made for Android devices. Um, so if you have an Android device, I can send you the 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 application itself that you can install on your app and run it. Um, but as I understand, most of us have an iPhone. So um, that's why I'm making those videos. Thank you so much for your attention. Let me know your thoughts.